goodness, this has got to be the highlight of my week. Seeing you all walk up here, I've missed you so much. What am I doing with this? Well, you're going to find out in just a minute. Your shoe came off. Oh my goodness, that's so silly. We better put that back on, though. There you go. All right, so I have a pretty cool story for you guys today, but before I tell it, I want you to see what I have here. Do you see how these are sitting separately? Do you see how still it's sitting? It looks almost peaceful, doesn't it? Now take a look. It's all moved around, it's all shaken up. Keep your eyes on this as I'm telling you my story, okay? So not too long ago, I took a trip with my family to Washington, D.C. And we stayed with our Uncle Tony and his daughter, Holly. And at this house, they have a dog named Tippy. Now, one night, we were sitting down for dinner, and we were eating together, and I look over, and Tippy is in her kennel with the door shut. And I was really surprised by this, because I know I didn't see anybody put Tippy in her kennel, but there she was. And the door was shut. And so Holly saw me looking at this, and she says, you know what Tippy does? Tippy goes in there, and she shuts the door at the end of the day. So that, hey. Chips are really loud. Yeah, they're, they're pretty crunchy. Chips, those are noisy too. So, <laughs> um, so Tippy was sitting there in her kennel with the door shut, and Holly told me, she goes in there at the end of the day and shuts the door on herself as if to say, you know what? I need a break. I need quiet. I need rest. Yep, do you see what's happening? As I'm holding this still, everything is separating. It's getting a little calmer again, right? And it's dark on the bottom and everything is splitting. That little puppy knew the importance of taking a break and taking rest. Do you want to know who else did? Jesus. And you know what he would do when he would take those breaths? He would talk to God. He would pray. It is so important to take a break sometimes. And Amelia, when we do that, <laughs> when we do that, we should really take some time to talk to God. When I'm feeling really overwhelmed and there's so much happening, I take a break and I talk to God and then I feel so much better. I feel more rested and I feel a little more still. Right, Caleb, do you have something to say? What do you have to share? You don't know? That's okay. If you remember, let me know, okay? Now we are headed back to Sunday school today. Who's excited? Yes. Isn't that cool? All right, we are going to, can I shake it again? Sure thing. And now it's all different. So we are going to walk over to the music room. Are you ready? Show me some walking feet, please. 